And today I'm going to mount this uh, Mini Scout Light Pro by Surefire. These are really good lights. I like them. I'm kind of excited about this because it's smaller and lighter weight, which is, uh, uh, you know, always best on my guns. The lighter they can be, the smaller this stuff is, is going to be better, right? But uh, this thing has 500 lumens, right? Uh, you know, goes 175 meters in distance, right? So uh, I'm going to mount this thing on this rifle today. I'm going to show you how I kind of do this. I'm going to take this thing out of the box and mount it on my gun. My gun is a Citizen Arms 14 and a half, uh, welded and pinned with the Surefire uh, War Comp on it. Um, this is a lightweight gun, sling, uh, sight, and with this flashlight, it's going to end up being about 5.1 pounds, right? So uh, I like this mini Scout Light because it's pretty light and it's simple, has a swivel on it. I'm going to put it on this, uh, this, I call these pushy clicky rails, right? But this is uh, a KDG rail uh, and it just locks into an M-lock slot. The reason I like them, uh, especially for flashlights, is I don't have to hard mount the flashlight to the gun. I can put it on this rail and then once it's mounted, I could just undo it and put it on another gun, right? So look, I'm just going to kind of mount it on the center of the rail here, right? Really simple common screwdriver. I'm going to tighten it down. There we go. Right. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to angle it down. And, and I really like this, how the, the light says uh, streamline to the gun. Now that it's on the clicky rail, I could put it anywhere I want on the front of the gun by easily just clicking it. And this is one things I really like about the the pushy clicky rails right i could put the flashlight on the top center now where do you mount a flashlight a lot of guys talk about this uh, back in the day i used to mount it on the bottom and i felt like for me that was the best protection of the light and the best place to use the light um, however some guys will say the the light being on the bottom the muzzle will leave a shadow on the target and you won't be able to read intent on someone's face, right? So uh, I've done I've done six o'clock, I've done nine o'clock. Um, I will say that if you mount it, let's say, you know, at the uh, one or two o'clock here, like it is right here, right? I can push the thumb switch with my thumb and then um, I, can, uh, I can have it in a place where I could easily get to it, but at the same time, the muzzle won't leave that shadow. So I think this is how I'm gonna mount it. I like that it swivels, right? And the swivel is kind of tight. I like that because it keeps the, the rifle, it keeps the, the Surefire as tight to the rifle as possible, right? And then these, uh, and then all I gotta do is pull it off, man, and I can throw this thing on another gun if I wanted. So this is how I'm gonna uh, set this thing up for my ultralight 14 and a half inch. I think this will probably, with this flashlight, we can throw it on the scale in a little bit, probably take the whole rifle set up to about 5.1, 5.2 pounds on my ultralight rifle. 